laugh, his smile will uh, stay with me. Uh, you know, just the, 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 the wisdom the man had, um, I'll never forget. Captain John Kelly described Captain Gary Mazone as a good man with high standards who enjoyed a good laugh from time to time. Captain Kelly was hired by Captain Mazone in 1996. Two years later, Captain Mazone would retire from the Vernon Police Department after 22 years of service. Mazone joined the Connecticut Division of Criminal Justice as an inspector in the office of the Chief's State's Attorney. In 2009, he'd begin serving in Litchfield State's Attorney's Office until his retirement on January 1st, 2019. 42 plus years in law enforcement, the, the, the service and dedication to the town of Vernon and the state of Connecticut is just uh, unheard of. Captain Kelly stayed in touch with Captain Mazone during those years. They'd work a couple of cases with one another, catch each other in passing, or chat over the phone from time to time. He was a wealth of knowledge. I mean, he knew the law inside and out. He knew uh, many, many people in the state of Connecticut. Um, he it just, whatever the issue I had, he, he seemed to have uh, some advice for that. When Kelly heard Mazone was involved in the crash, he was in shock. Just can't imagine, you know, uh, that he's not around, he's not here with us anymore, or you can't pick up the phone to uh, ask those questions anymore. Captain Mazone had an impact on many lives during his 42 years of public service. Law enforcement we talked to said he was loved by all. State Public Safety Commissioner James Ravella read the names of the 14 people deceased and injured in the B-17 bomber crash at Bradley International Airport. He choked up as he read Mazone's name. Gary Mazone, age 66. The Special Olympics Connecticut held a special place in Mazone's heart. He participated annually in the Law Enforcement Torch Run. In 2008, he was elected into the Law Enforcement Torch Run Hall of Fame. As recently as a month ago, he supported the Vernon Police Department in the EDGE Challenge, held in support of the Special Olympics. Uh, Special Olympics is a big thing with the Vernon Police Department, and uh, you know his, he, uh, he always had uh, that support for us. In a statement, the Special Olympics said, quote, We are deeply saddened to hear the passing of retired Captain Gary Mazone. Our hearts are with his family, friends, and brothers and sisters in law enforcement. We will always be grateful for and remember the caring and meaningful ways he supported our organization and athletes.